definitely time for these girls to go out in their chicken coop. They are figuring out how to escape out of their tub. I had to put some boards. They still have plenty of room for air in there, but I had to put some boards around here to try to contain them in the tub. Hopefully we'll have you a home tomorrow, little chickies. Well, the plan for today is to build us a chicken pen. And I came out here to try to get started on that, try to get an inventory of what materials I already have. And I've always said, see that behind me here, you can see a building. When we actually started building this before we started building our house over here. And so I got started on the building first while I was waiting on getting my building materials. And, uh, but then I got my building permit and everything faster than I could get this thing built. So this thing is sit here for maybe two years without any type of progress on it. And the grass all grew up around behind it and around it. So I said last year that, that when that grass died, uh, before it got growing too good this year that I'd, I'd, try to get in so I got mowed around mostly I ran out of fuel with my mower going to have to go get some mower but I got it mowed to where I can get up to my building without worrying about getting bit by a snake or anything like that but uh, got to get an inventory of materials here to get anything done because there is so much to do I was going to get my trailer back here and start loading up materials but to haul the trailer around I need the tractor and I need to take the blade off the tractor but before I took the blade off the tractor I wanted you can kind of see right here where we're parking the Honda car uh, we're wearing out the grass back here and uh, I wanted to get some of the stone in my stone pile back here and kind of widen the driveway out a little bit. And so I'm gonna widen out the driveway so I can take off the blade, so I can haul the trailer down there so I can get material so that I can build a chicken coop. I don't think it's gonna get very far with this chicken coop today. Well, I measured through all my material and right here is the chicken coop. Doesn't look like much but I didn't really calculate how many scrap pieces of two by four I would need, so there's actually gonna be probably some leftover materials here. Um, that plywood's for the floor. I don't have the plywood broken apart yet for, for the siding, but for the most part, this is the structure of the chicken coop. Time to get cutting it up. One of the joys of having a bunch of kids is that your tools are never where you can find them, never where you left them. One of those frustrations I'm experiencing today is my hammer. The only hammer I can locate at the moment is this smaller, like a, I guess it's a 13 ounce hammer used for finishing work and I'm gonna use it to try to build the chicken pen. Tomorrow, I'll have three or four hammers of various different sizes, but it'll be a different tool I can't find. the end of the day this is as far as I made it but we I had to kind of stop and get an area to put the chickens in so I made them a little box here we can it's just a piece of sheet metal we can 
kind of raise and lower over it. Mom, we got the chicks in Mom? here. Yep. I'm a little bit worried about how hot it's going to get in there during the day when the sun's beating down on them. Probably should have done it on the other side opposite the sun. But they're in there. They were had to get them out of the container they were in. What kind of notes you keeping? Here's the front. Kind of see how it's taking shape. I'm gonna have a roof over it like that. Like where, where the chicks are now. I'm gonna build some boxes in there. Make a better way to raise and lower that roof. And uh, but we'll be able to raise it and get in just like they're peering right now and get, get the eggs. And they'll come down a walkway into their yard here. You can see the outline of what their yard's gonna be. We're gonna enclose all of this with chicken wire and have a roof over it. Chicken wire. So they'll be able to get in here underneath their coop back here and uh, eat bugs and whatever they eat up off the ground. That's as far as we made it this weekend. Had to try to work on it some more next weekend.